All right, so if you're one of those people who are getting the error message on the Epic Games Launcher that says an error has occurred in the Epic Games Launcher and uh, you should say 500 error, 500. So I'm gonna show you in this video how to fix it 1%. So it's gonna be pretty simple to fix and you don't have to worry about anything. So if you guys go to the Twitter and if you read, Epic Games have actually said that there is some error. It's giving you 500 error or uh, Epic Launcher crashing or something like that. So I'm just gonna show you guys how to fix that, okay? But before that, let's read the tweet. We are currently experiencing high traffic on the Epic Games uh, store. So basically, uh, there's like a lot of people trying to log in because there's a free game called GTA 5. So obviously we're getting this error message and stuff like that. So anyway, how to fix that is pretty simple. So easy to do, it's gonna fix 100%. So all you wanna do is you wanna go to the search bar and search for Epic Games Launcher, okay? So go to the search bar, search for Epic Games Launcher and you have to uninstall it, okay? And do not worry, it's not gonna uninstall any of your game. If you have Fortnite, it's not gonna uninstall your game. It's not even gonna delete your uh, login info. You will be logged in still. So uninstall the uh, Epic Game Launcher and when you uninstall the Epic Game Launcher, you might get an error that says the application has crashed and it's completely fine. You, you, you're you supposed to get that error message while you're uninstalling. So this message right here, simply close to that and you have to reinstall the Epic Games Launcher again. And once you reinstall the Epic Games Launcher again, you will see that there's going to be an update and it's going to be around 300 to 380 megabytes. Depends on your version of the Epic Games Launcher. I downloaded the latest version, so I have the 300 megabytes, the uh, 300 megabytes update. So you just have to update that. And now once the update is done, the Epic Games Launcher is going to restart and you will see that you're going to be already logged in. It's not going to delete anything, okay? You just have to reinstall the Epic Games Launcher and it will take you to your account and you will log in completely fine without any error and you will get to the um, message. Like, you know, you'll get to the home screen where you can actually download the free game that is GTA 5. So this is how you can actually fix the Epic Games Launcher error that is um, happening to a lot of people. And if you guys find this video useful, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos like tech videos and stuff like that. So I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.